Hey guys, so I'm actually getting ready to go to Ikea because I am doing my vanity over and I'm so excited. I'm like really happy. So this is going to be my first like vlog, which I'm kind of excited for. But I am taking a trip to Ikea so I can get the Alex drawers, the lac shelf, and an additional um, something. You guys see when I get there. And we are at Ikea. So here we have the Ikea lac shelf and it's 59 I will be grabbing this today. And here we have the dresser. And I'm going to show you before what my vanity looks like. This mirror, I mean mirror, crazy girl. This picture literally just fell. But this is how my vanity looks right now. It's really messy. Um, I just took everything out this drawer and getting rid of a lot of clothes. But when you guys come back, it's going to look totally different. I was going to buy a new vanity. I really don't feel like dropping money on it. So I will be being cheap and spray painting this bad boy white. So we have remove one down. The next is going is this desk. I am pulling all this makeup out. Going through this. Got to pull this out and take those clothes out. Figure out what I'm doing with these bins. And yeah. And this is where I'm at. I threw them out. I'm getting ready to build um, my desk and this one is going bye bye. And this is what we're at. All my makeup, took it out, taking this picture down, makeup galore everywhere. Built this desk, getting rid of stuff. So it's not done yet, nowhere near done, but I just wanted to show you guys how much space I have. If you guys remember, well, I had a former desk, but this, it closes. Oh, I could fit way, so much more stuff in here, but this one, it just slide out and it was like, it stopped literally like right here on my other one. So this, I can like fill it up. I could, oh. I have, I'm like so excited y'all, I have so much space just to add more makeup in, but the memories I had, but I'm so excited, like I can't, I can't wait till this is done, and we are going to say goodbye to Cynthia, so I just did the first process of building this. I'm going to put the drawers in and I'll show you what it looks like when it's done. So right now I built the drawer. And I'm just adding um, my stuff in here, some palettes. Um, Y'all, this is holding one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven palettes. On, that's like unheard of. Oh my God, I'm like shook right now. This was definitely worth the money. So right now we're in my bathroom. Um, all these palettes right here are actually going in that Alex draw. Um, palettes in here too. I have makeup in this drawer. So I'm excited to like put all this makeup in here so I can have it home. So. Really happy about that. And now I have that IKEA lac shelf that I'm putting together. The other pieces are right behind me. And honestly, this looks a lot easier than the desk in the attic straw. 
and this is where I'm at. It's so crazy how much more space I have. This is like a good 8 inches right there. Because before, oh, this makes such a big difference, y'all. Okay, so off camera, what I did is I took some Gorilla Spray and um, just spray this to make it nice and tacky. You let this sit for one minute. So before applying this, I already sprayed it. You're going to take your, your liner, your linen. Just want to match this evenly. Oops. And literally, that's all that it is. What I'm going to do with this, it, there's an outlet right here. I'm just going to take my, my scissors. I'm going to cut. I'm going to cut right here. So off camera, I spray painted the vanity white. I'm probably going to do like three to four coats of this. I'm going to let this sit for like 30 to 40 minutes. I'm going to do another coat. And then I'm going to do a black. I mean black. I have to do the back because it's still black. So we did a second paint of coat. And while I was out here, I also painted this elephant. And I have my heater out here to help with the drying process. This is the paint I use for my vanity. And this is the paint I use for the elephant. Now I actually have three more of these and I'm still deciding if I want to paint um, or just leave them black. But yeah, um, also because I do rent, I don't, I can't bring it outside, it's actually snowing where I'm at. So I went to Dollar Tree and I just bought this rug and um, this thing to protect the walls and stuff so I won't get in trouble with the landlord. Finally completed my vanity that I am so, 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 so in love with. Um, yeah, I actually, this is the same mirror I always had, so I actually just spray painted it a white because I really didn't want to buy a new vanity. I didn't have the funds for it. So this was a frugal way to change it up. Um, this drawer is actually from Ikea. This is the Alex drawer, and this is the lack shelf from Ikea. Um, my chair I actually got from um, TJ Maxx on clearance for like $49. I'm going to move this over just a little. And my desk is from Ikea as, as well. It's the Mickey collection and it costs $50. Guys, when I tell you this holds so much makeup, it's unbelievable compared to my older desk that I had, which was a pullout. It wasn't even a draw. So um, I'm, I'm really excited about it because, you know, I don't have makeup falling out. Uh, I don't have to worry about this sliding off the rack, off the... It's perfect. It holds so much makeup in. I'm really excited. So what I'm going to do is we're going to go into detail and show you um my room. Also, I did my walls over, you know, just to brighten it up. Um, I added a chandelier in here. So I'm going to show you all this stuff right after. So stay tuned, guys. Okay, guys. So this picture I got from um, TJ Maxx for $20. These are flowers I got from my friend's baby shower about two to three years ago. Actually, maybe longer than that. These, these are pretty old. Um, and yeah, this was free. I actually got a lot of people on Facebook has been asking me about these acrylic boxes. So Charlotte Rue is actually closing. So they had these acrylic boxes on sale for $2. I was like, well, you know what? Let me snatch them up and grab them. Um, I got these two both from um, either Marshalls or TJ Maxx. I don't remember the price, but I want to say they were probably under $10 because 
try to be very cheap when I shop. These boxes are from actually Do Dollar Tree, believe it or not. These are from the Dollar Tree for a dollar a piece, so I grabbed them. More stuff back here. I have two vanity mirrors. This is my first vanity mirror that I'm going to keep forever because, you know, started from the bottom, now I'm here. This is another one I picked up from Ulta. This actually has a light on it as well and it plays Bluetooth, so it plays music. Over here I have just some makeup brushes. I have every Nicki Minaj perfume besides the new one that just dropped is the Queen one, so I'm waiting for that one. Over here, just some more makeup. I actually got this at Primark on clearance. I love cockatoos and parakeets and macaws, and I was like, oh, I have to get this. Starting right here, I have a Gucci bag. I have some more acrylic stuff. I believe I got this also at Dollar Tree. I'm not sure. This is um from the Nicki Minaj collection. It's like a perfume, dust powder, whatever that is. Up here, I have a makeup case from Ulta. I have elephants my mom gave me years ago. I actually spray painted them silver because I was over the black. Um, here, I actually got this on clearance. This cute bag, like seven, eight years ago from TJ Maxx, for like three dollars. So I like this handbag a lot. Here I have some um, Louis Vuitton. Uh, is it gonna zoom in for me? Okay, right here I have these cute little Louis Vuitton like um keychain holder so I put them in here I think it gives it a great look I have a Givenchy um, powder was it powder brush yeah right here I have a Kat Von D perfume my oil guys these are some makeup brushes that it's so cute so like when I seen these I had to grab them I haven't used them yet so they're just sitting in the collection to look cute I don't want to drop anything over here because it's such a tight fit. Back here, I have some limited edition MAC lipsticks that I got from Ulta on clear, um, for the, uh, can you think, the Christmas collection. So that, right here, I have some of my favorite Juvia palettes. Down here, I have my books that look just really good on my vanity, I should say. Um, I actually have this book is Iman. And I have um, Asian faces, so how to do makeup on Asians and stuff like that. Here I have Kim Selfie's book. I have Amber Rose, How to Be a Bad Bitch. I have a nail book here. I actually picked this elephant up at TJ Maxx for like $5.99. So I have that here. Here I just have all right here is just jewelry. That's pretty much it. Now we go into the draw. And it's just various items, stuff that I use pretty much on an everyday basis. What I reach for is like my highlighters and my concealer. That's what's here. So there's a lot of makeup in here. I still haven't organized it yet. Now here, I have just palettes, stuff that I just try to grab because it's easy to grab too. That's here. Here I have my ABH, some more Juvia, more palettes, cargo palettes back here. Here I have um, more palettes, more highlighter, just eyeshadow palettes. This is the eyelash um, draw. This is all eyelashes and just eyelash glue. Um, various items. I'm still not done organizing. Um, various items. I'm still not done organizing. Let's put this back up here. Various items. Right here, I have um, my um, my Morph palettes, and I also have my High Frequency Machine in here. Uh, right here, I have um, palettes back here. And when I tell you this holds a lot of makeup, it holds a lot of makeup. Um, a lot of people love the walls on Facebook, so. This is how the wall came out, and I, I love it. It just gives the room such an overall bright look and I also did it on the bottom part as well now here I have my elephants that I spray painted that I love as well this is how they came out and my cute little birdie cage now right here this 
is what changes the room. It's a chandelier. And it's actually a plug-in chandelier. If you didn't know, they make them, guys. So I got this chandelier on Amazon for $96 because it was used. If you buy a brand new, I think it's $126, something like that. So, you know, I saved a few bucks getting it um, used. But I did drill it in the wall, in the ceiling. And, guys, my ceiling is concrete. It took me an hour to drill this in. But I got it drilled in. I taped up the outlets and stuff. And with this, guys, let me zoom in. You actually have to do the electrical work on this yourself, which I was able to do. Um, it comes with directions. It's really easy. This is my first time ever doing electrical work. It's not really electrical work, but it's my first time doing it. And um, if I can do it, guys, you can do it. It's super easy. And it gives the room such a bright look. Um, like I said, I got this um, on Amazon. I will put the link in the description. These are daytime light bulbs. I got these light bulbs from um, Home Depot over here. I also did this wall as well, just so the reflection can bounce back off each other. And this is it. I've gotten rid of my other pictures that were here. And this is what I'm working with. My birthday dress. Um... Got this dress from AliExpress. It's supposed to be the remake of the Kendall Jenner dress when she was 21 years old. So that I have my seating area right here. But as of right now, I have makeup brushes sitting on here. Oh, this is uh, my area right here. I have a Bible. Um, a picture of me and my grandmother. My elephant. picture of Yanni. And um, yeah. Now another part that I love about my room is this mirror. I'm always taking selfies in it. People always ask me, where'd you get the lights come? Did the lights come with this mirror? And guys, I'm gonna back up. This mirror is pretty tall. Probably the same height as me, maybe taller. But what this mirror is, I actually added these LED light strips. I wanna say these cost like $13 or so. But yeah, you just plug, um, they're sticky. You just put them on the mirror. And right here, it has a, uh, so you can dim it. But yeah. Oh, also, guys were asking me, the same thing I did with my daughter's room, I did it to my room as well. Just in this area, I didn't do the other side, I'm still debating on it. But, just the flooring. But it, it came out good. I did the same effort in Ayani's room. I put, um, poster board on the floor. Then I added the tile on top, and it makes a huge difference. And this is my room, guys. My handbags, um, clothes that I have too many of, but this is how it came out. And I love it so much. Um, you know, I'm actually in the process of doing the living room over, which I will record that as well. But... Guys, when I tell you I'm in love with this, like, it's so calming and soothing coming in here after a long day just to come down and relax, and I love it. Even, like, I, I am in love with marble print. Even my, my bed sheets are marble print. My pillows are marble print. Um, someone asked me about these earlier. I got these, if I, could, if I still have the link, I will link it. I got these pictures from AliExpress both of them for like seven dollars a piece and these I my mom gave these to me I don't remember but I actually spray painted them silver years ago these are actually candle holders so I have to find some candles to put in here but when I when you see the before guys you're gonna be like what the heck you was really living like that girl but I love it and it looks great And this is my bed.